remove the hydraulic for the arm on this thing. What's going on here? How is it? Why, why is the tractor moving? The middle mouse button will move that arm lock. Yeah. But it moves the tractor behind you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Yeah, I'm you gotta figure you, out how to close these fucking pincers down. <laughs> it's double, you it's move both the, mouse buttons. The what? Both mouse buttons simultaneously. Oh. That I didn't know. Haven't you been doing this like for hours now? Not with this though, I've been dropping them straight in from the, the truck. Oh, yeah, okay, alright. The only one that I've had that was a bad shot. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, that's better. <laughs> well, I'm still amazed that you could... Did you use the middle mouse button to rotate the tractor in front of you? Is that where yeah, you, you see the arm that comes from this to the tractor? It actually moves. Yeah. <laughs> so if I press the middle mouse button, it wiggles the back of the tractor. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why you'd want to do that, mate. <laughs> Interesting. No, I don't think that's what it's for. No, I don't know what it's for. Probably when it's not connected or something, it'll do something. I don't know. Interesting. That's a better shot, though. Looks like you're cutting the grass faster than it's seeding. <laughs> it's growing back quicker than <laughs> the times on one food. Damn, we're cutting these fields fast, but uh, nothing there. Are you almost full there, Dracor? 65. Oh, okay. I think I purchased Login Simulator 2015, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I seem to be enjoying the most so far. <laughs> it's good that they combined it, though. I never really saw a reason why that should be two separate games. Yeah. If you do, just double check that uh, it's Giant that has uh, produ produced it. Yeah, I, I can't say for sure. I just well, I'm pretty sure I saw a woodcutter simulator. I think it was called. Yeah, it, it was. Um, if I remember rightly, it was them dodgy rip-off people. Oh really? The uh, UIG or whatever it is. Oh, oh yeah. Well, that might be. There's a construction as well, construction simulator. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't look as fun as farming farming sim does. No, it doesn't. What was a simulator for near enough anything these days? There was one come out the other week, wasn't there, Trade Call? Just before Arcade was released, they were like, ah, oh, it's released in a couple of hours, I'll see if it's. Um, see what price it is, and it was garbage simulator. We go around <laughs> picking all the rubbish up and stuff. It was like 24 quid, it wasn't worth getting. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get it, Tricor? <laughs> no, I, oh, that little one? Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean the garbage simulator. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no it's a rip off. 24 quid. And then, like, it launched, and everyone's like, like, they did like, half a video on it, and then realized that the game was broken. Like professional farmer 2014. What a joke that was. 
it was completely broken they patched it a few times and then decided to release DLC on an already broken game did any of you ever oh, ever play that agricultural simulator or whatever oh yeah no that's, that's by like UIG that. as well isn't it? that is a uh, frustrating game to play <laughs> it's it, it's got a lot of potential though I, I, I mean I like the principles of the game even more than farming sim actually but it's so badly done and it's so buggy and it's so frustrating that uh. definitely a UIG game <laughs> great demand that shipping office for sugar beet ok I'm gonna go sell sugar beet but I do have uh, agricultural both 11 and 13 um, but both are just as bad what I, the only thing I remember about that is like uh, that you actually made like a 3D impact in the ground when you were plowing and such which I yep. found kind of cool and from what I read uh, e that exact feature is a l is the root of a lot of the unstab instability issues that the game has had Mm. Holy heck, it's quarter past ten. Yeah, we wait a lot of time. <sighs> I've got to sleep at some point. That'd be right, <laughs> No, you don't. I've still sleep got with your dead. Arcade farms to do, and then like five hours of farming <laughs> on my own save game. <laughs> yeah, I've got a lot of to do on my save game as well, but that'd be right. <laughs> <laughs> I was away for 20 hours and anyways before I got a few hours kept, so, yeah. I'm just gonna... It was 24 hours those offers were, wasn't it? The, the great demand? I think some of Turn them are like speed down. Some yeah. of them are for... You'll blow right by it. Like 6 hours or something. Alright, I'll turn the speed down to really large one. I like how uh, you can see it especially in this big uh, trailer here how the point at which you load load it is where it stacks up the highest. Yeah, that's a good new feature that. Yeah. There's a mod for that for 13 as well. If everything that's in this game is So mod many mods for this uh, for this game. Yeah, I guess so. But I, I never really got very much into the mods because half of them seemed to fuck up my game and the other half was in German. Yeah, well, <laughs> there's only a few sites that is even worth getting it from, kind of thing. Like, some of them are just too dodgy. There was, like, they, they posted some on the official page, but they never, they were, there's like, there was like 10 or 15 of them and that's it. They never updated <laughs> as long as I was checking. No, there's fun, like, there's millions on there. Like, not millions, but there's... There's like well, when six I was or seven anyway. pages. Well, then you haven't played for like a year or something, has it? No, no, it's a long been time. A while. Long. Yeah, they, they were putting quite a few on. But like the forest mod was like out for a few months, which is pretty much all the stuff that's in this one, like the chipper and stuff. There we go. Got to some money again. Speed it up. I wonder what they uh, what they really do if if so much of, of the uh, of what's in this game has been mods. If they buy the rights from the creators or they just do a blatant uh, ripoff or something. Well, as well, it's not ripper. it's not a blatant ripoff of their thing because the software that you use to make the mod giants own anyway. And all that stuff, like they own everything. This oh, is my yeah. biggest issue with mods, though, because uh, also this is a new engine, so it can't be exactly the. You know, they have to have rewritten most of it, right? Uh, yeah, but they released the um, the mod making thing like last week. 
the giant editor thing was released oh. like like the new version for 2015 was released last week. But here's here's what sucks with mods, and this happens in every game that is heavily based off of mods. Like there's some games coming out now that's basically saying like, okay, we're giving you an engine, and we hope that you make it a good game by making mods that makes it playable yeah. or makes anything to do. And the problem there is that when, like, whenever someone that made a great mod stops updating it and stops playing the game, then no one can keep updating that mod unless yeah. he actively gives them the rights to do so. I think the main problem with mods in Farm Sim is that, like, someone will, pri will make a private edit of a tractor and just give it to his friends, and then they'll go on, make videos on it and stuff, and then everyone's like, oh, can I have that? Can I have the link for that? And it's like, no, it's private, it's private, it's private. Which is a bit ridiculous, really. But yeah. But I just don't. I just don't like. I don't mind the mods in and of itself. I just mind that if companies are basing their game off of it only being fun if there is mods in it, and they don't yeah, own well, the mods. This game, you don't need mods because most of the mods are just different chapters that they don't have the. Yeah, no, that's yeah. fine. But like, uh, who, who was it? There was there was some game that ticked me off with this recently. I can't remember which it was. I think it was Space Engineers actually. Not that they're not adding things. They're adding a lot of things, but they're also saying there's certain things that just we know that people are going to mod it, so we're not going to bother to do it ourselves. Yeah. And yeah, and I've already there's been tons of examples in Space Engineers where. Some guy stopped playing the game, and that mod is still his, so no one else can update it. It's just sitting there, wasted. Yeah, like uh, it doesn't work anymore, but no one can make it work because he owns it. That's why. And no one can make anything. Stuff. Yeah, exactly. And no one, no one can make a copy either. Like no one can make something similar because he still owns like the rights for it. It's a bit interesting to hear that now that I uh, I started playing Space Engineers uh, just a few year, few weeks ago. <laughs> no, don't get me wrong. Space Engineers is a fantastic game. It's one of the best games I've played in a long time. But yeah, it is. And they do they do like gigantic updates every Thursday, like except last Thursday and the next couple of Thursday they're only doing bug fixes, which is needed so i'm glad they're doing it but pretty much every other thursday for as long as i can remember they've added some like game changing feature basically oh yeah i started playing it really early like and the stuff that they've got now is far far different from when i first started and it's actually amazing what they're doing yeah and like on a weekly basis uh. what is their ramp you have to collect all the ore and stuff to make everything to make the ships and stuff well, yeah. only in survival mode you can do it in build a mod if you want to, so you can just build got, things off scratch. Got creative mode as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what I did to do some. Uh, it's oh, a really, a really cool game. It's time for me to go. Sorry, but I cannot stay with you. Because my stream is kaput. And my net speed is decreasing. Okay. Well, what did you say? Uh, you uh, you have to leave? Uh, I have to leave. Sorry for that. No worries. You're welcome back. Uh, after I resolve the internet problem. Oh, you can always, you know, doesn't it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't if you don't if you don't see the stream. You don't know what's going on. You're just hearing us. <laughs> kind of weird. Yeah, I don't know what's uh, going on if, uh, with the stream there, but uh, good luck with fixing it. Forty kilometers of me, it's a snowstorm. So. <laughs> oh okay. Yeah, that's not good. Bye bye guys. Bye bye. Yeah. Later. Okay bye. Thanks for the Take keys, care, man. Baby. And more logs to be delivered. Yo. <laughs> Another truck full. Bit overloaded, but never mind. <laughs> Is it sewing time, uh, Traker? <laughs> yeah. Uh, did somebody mention plowing time first? 
Yeah, I thought we were going to plow all them, like some of the fields together, Trico. Should I buy oh, a yeah, better we, plow? Yeah, we have a small plow. Yeah. Should I get a better one? It's pretty, pretty small the one we have, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, but you're only doing those. You're only doing those roads. It's not really like you need a big one. It's not like it's something we're going to use very often. Oh, okay. But it, yeah. Oh my god, I'm happy that I upgrade when I, uh, when I do use it. Where, where are you thinking about plowing? Making some fields together, and then we'll chop all the trees. Oh right, down. okay. Yeah, then we don't need a big one. Huh? Oh my god, all of those are wheeled ones. Oh, I hate those. Yeah, things. we should put a 24 and 25 together, and 29 and 30. Yeah, and then we'll get guy that come up and chop the trees down that around the whole field, so the stuff doesn't get us stuck. <laughs> oh, yeah, but that's okay. That's where the uh, stump remover comes in handy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But so we're gonna leave a gap uh, between yeah, leave the road 24, 25, and uh, 29, 30. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I mean, it's up to you guys. Yeah, I mean, I'm in principle, I'm not fan of that those gargantuan feel gargantuan fields anyway. I think the the one that's gonna create le least of a mess for the. Uh, for the hired worker is if you can yeah just combine 29 30 and 24 25 yeah i agree on that and leave the center road yeah yeah because otherwise it's going to be yeah I've, I've done that mistake in the previous one and the guy just got very confused <laughs> oh money coming in though my hired worker last night fertilized one of the fields and just drove to the next one and carried on fertilizing. <laughs> <laughs> Might be giving a bonus. <laughs> no, it's, a, it's the two that are together. Um, well, like right next, the two starter fields, and the guy was planting one field, and I had the other hired worker doing the. Uh, Mind fertilizing. if I use this uh, tractor, Carolina? No problem. Because I want to plow with the bigger one. The big one can be annoy annoying to plow on. Oh, yeah. that's right. We got one bigger. All right, I'll use yeah, that. Yeah, the blue then. one. But that one turns in the center. Uh, if you have, uh, if you use keyboard, I would say the uh, the big one is hopeless to plow plow with. Yeah, I I think I seem to remember that since it turns in the middle, so pushing the if, plow around. If you're using a gamepad or similar, it might be usable. I don't think it'll be that bad because all you're doing is getting rid of that little dirt road in between the two. Yeah, you just have to be very careful when, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so true. you're going straight anyway. You're not really turning on that. Yeah. And another thing, uh, if we upgrade the plows, uh, that will have a turn in it anyway. So maybe it would not be that much of an issue, issue if so. Well, yeah, but I just saw those plows are actually quite expensive. And if we're just going to remove a couple of pieces there can, might as well buy something else instead yeah so we're not, not gonna upgrade mm, no no we have uh, let's see we just got some more money we have 135k now yeah I'm, I'm personally I'm good with not upgrading yeah cool want to see some trees removing ramp um just the ones around up by the house and stuff like by 20 I can't even remember I'm tapped out and working um, 29.24 is it? Uh, like the around the two fields. Well, like at yeah, at near 25, there might be a couple, but like at at field 30, the tractor and stuff gets stuck, you know, in that corner by you, where you spawn in. Yeah, by where the chicken thing is. Yeah. The map. Well, yeah, like just oh. up from there, you'll see it on the on the edge of the field. I'll take the blue tractor after. Uh... Yeah, no problem. And uh, I'll grab the uh, the stump remover. Yeah, that'll be a good idea. I'm just gonna leave this weight here by the road. Oh, you can teleport that back, can't you, or something? Yeah. Um. Oh yeah. It's over here. <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay, I see what you mean. It's a bit front-heavy without it. Yeah. 
That's why it was really handy before with it. And when you teleported off, I had a tree on there as well. Oh no! <laughs> Dang it. Can, can you, like, tip me? Have you flipped door? Yeah. Move the arm down, I'll pick it. Move it, that's what I did. Yeah, I'm trying. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've gone like right over. Freaking turtle. Oh, <laughs> you use that front loader just like I do. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Oh, uh, will this thing be able to fake you up? <laughs> oh, I have the yellow one up there. Hold on, I'll go grab that one. Uh, yeah, I'll be able to scoop you up. I don't think this will be able to. Potatoes. Uh, someone want to sell potatoes? I can do that. Well, then, there's the, the truck is speed. there. <laughs> the truck is somewhere up there. Right <laughs> Wrong way, I'm just on his roof now. <laughs> <laughs> We're working uh, on I it. There we go. <laughs> Not there. You go. <laughs> I didn't see uh, the road disappearing when you plowed through it. Have you activated? Yeah, I'm the... looking myself. Yeah, I turned it on, but now it's uh, uh, it has I to say limit the fields, right? Yeah, I, th no, oops, I think it's... yeah, you need to um, enable that oh, for yeah. him to be able to do uh, to the Let's design. See. It might be in the admin setting. Yeah, but I have but to I... do. I have to set separate accounts first, then. So you actually have to read allow create fields. Then. Or hold on, let's. Um, yeah, it's I had that problem before. It's because it's multiplayer. See, see if it works now. Bob's might have to do it himself. I did turn it on you now, but I haven't set separate accounts. You don't need separate accounts for it, I think. But you need to enable uh, enable uh, uh, create fields. I did. Yeah, I think that should be enough. And then turn it on on the cloud, should be cool. There she goes. Excellent. Yeah, I had it on, but it wasn't working. I couldn't figure out why. Yeah, it's a server setting. Are we going the right way here? Are we going towards the farms? There they are. I wish there was a way to acknowledge the uh, great demand and uh, make the map stop blinking. <laughs> oh my god, that be makes me crazy. Yeah, it's annoying as hell, isn't it? It is. It is. I've turned down the speed, by the way, so you should shouldn't be a rush to get there. Yeah, I saw that. By the way, does anyone know if uh, in 2013 the prices were adjusted at at the whole hour, so you could uh, yeah, basically the use the whole hour to sell stuff? Right. Is it yeah. the same and then thing it here? Flips at, at the hour. Yeah, it turns at the hour on this as well. Okay. Logging crew coming through. Where's the trees that we need to remove? Is it along the field? They're all by 30. Come on, truck, you can get up the hill. Come on, son. <laughs> <laughs> Pull that tail then. <laughs> by 30. Need to count it all right uh, now. those ones in a little hole there. Or I like between the rows. 
This could be fun. Full speed with the potatoes gives me about eight to nine kilometers an hour. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yep. Are you on auto drive? Because I set yep. that truck to uh, to super slow to follow the combine. No, it's it's not. It's set to full speed. The hell? I've been driving like 61 the whole time. But when I uh, <laughs> when I hold it forward myself, it gets me like 35-ish. I'm uh, changed speed control. Welcome back. I kind of fixed the problem. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, basically the uh, cruise control was set at maximum. Uh, I just uh, took it one da one notch down and uh, one back up, and uh, it's all right. Okay. Right, I'll be back in five minutes. So the truck should be pretty quick. Normally. Got eighteen percent in this silo full. All right, with cool. grass. <laughs> oh yeah, you're working on the grass there. <laughs> well, we only have that little tiny, the tiny collector, but. Do we have to split these trees into smaller pieces? Uh, <laughs> yeah, probably. Is it a pain because of the branches on these as well? Right? I'm gonna debranch them first before I do anything else. Yeah, the shape of these are really annoying. Running in there with a saw going so I can hit any branches I see. <laughs> You're probably a better with the tractor lifter thing than I am though, so if you wanna... I can cut it up and you can lift it if you want. Yeah. Then again, then it might be invisible for you that I've removed the branches. Yeah, I'm, I'm going around lobbing them as well, you say. Oh yeah, okay. Maybe we should grab the bigger uh, trailer for this. There's quite a lot of trees. Yeah, we could do. We could chuck them all on that. Okay, potatoes are sold. Excellent. Get rid of it all in one go. Then. Yeah. I'll teleport that up here. <laughs> <laughs> 